Hi everyone, Julie Jaquel, real estate agent in Irvine, California. Uh, this is Tracy. Tracy Kaiser, I'm an attorney in Orange County and I, my practice consists mostly of estate planning, yeah. uh, trust administrations, uh, probate, yeah. and I try to stay in that world. Okay, great. So today we're uh, trying to ask Tracy a few questions. I know a few, of you, uh, a lot of you asked me a question about family trust after you purchase a property. So Tracy, what is the, uh, why is it important to have a family trust? A trust allows uh, the person who's buying that real estate or who has a substantial amount of assets, and actually you don't even need a lot of assets. It's really when you own real estate, you have to have a revocable living trust. And what that does is it allows you to be able to transfer your assets down to your children or the people that you love, it doesn't have to be your children, um, in a way that's orderly and allows us to stay out of probate court. Okay, sounds good. So uh, it will save us time and money. It saves time and money, okay. a lot. Okay. Uh, usually in probate, your mm -hmm. it's cost it takes about a year. Mm -hmm. uh, you can do a revocable living trust in about sixty days. Okay, yeah. so let's say, uh, for example, five million dollars estate. How much would be uh, uh, attorney fees, all the fees, courts fees, if you don't have a trust? If you don't have a trust for a five million dollar estate, mm -hmm. which a lot of us may might be kind of in near Orange there, County, even in the millions, yeah. 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 Um, you're looking at probably around 60000 Oh, wow. Um, okay. So uh, approximately. And mm -hmm. the interesting thing about a probate is mm -hmm. the attorney makes that money, mm -hmm. but then the person who's the administrator makes the same amount. Oh, wow. So okay. those funds don't go to the family members. They have mm -hmm. to be paid out to different people, mm -hmm. individuals. Okay. When you do a revocable living trust, you mm -hmm. might be paying maybe Three thousand, four thousand, mm -hmm. uh, maybe oh, okay. uh, you know, and, but definitely mm -hmm. much cheaper, substantially cheaper to be able to do a trust. So here, I have a question. Um, let's say, for example, the parents pass away and the kids take over. They they want to sell the house. If they have a family trust, can they just take the trust paperwork and give it to me, and then we can open escrow and sell that property? Yeah. So okay. they're going to provide the trust paperwork to you or to escrow. Mm -hmm. And because the property mm -hmm. via the grant deeds already in the trust, mm -hmm. the person who's appointed as the successor trustee, the person yeah. who gets to sign all the paperwork, okay. all they do is sign the documents. Okay. And then we, if we, they don't have a trust paperwork, then they have to go through the court. Correct. Wait for a year and the 60000 on the $5 million. Correct. Okay. Correct. Sounds good. It, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so Tracy, if we do a family trust, what does that include? Whitney? A trust covers, mm -hmm. it should cover, okay. um, it should recover the revocable living trust, mm -hmm. it should cover the pour over will, the advanced health care directive, the uh, durable power of attorney for assets, usually a certificate of trust, and then what the attorney should do is they should help fund the assets into the trust so that when you create a trust, it's kind of like maybe make a bucket of water and if you don't fill the bucket with something or fill it with water, then it doesn't really operate. So the trust is a, is a mechanism, but then you have to take your assets and place the assets into the trust. Okay, that's great. And uh, you said the will and the power of attorney will be included. That's Correct. fantastic. Uh, can I ask you how much does a trust cost? Just at the ballpark. Sure. Yeah. I, uh, average 3000 to 5000 okay. probably for, for a, a decent estate. Okay. So not too expensive. Okay. And then once you uh, select a trustees, uh, can you change them? Or I guess my question is, can you amend the trust later on? Every, you Make can, changes you can on the terms? Every year. Every year. Okay. You can do any, and the amendments usually are two pages. Okay. So it's not a whole new trust again, okay. which is beautiful. It doesn't take long and it's inexpensive. Okay, fantastic. So, yeah. Well, thank, thank you so much. If we come up with more questions, can I get get in touch with you? And anytime, anytime, absolutely. Okay. Thank you so much, and we'll see you next time. If you need an experienced real estate agent in Irvine, California, text me. I'll be happy to help.